Hello, this is Tony Riggs with Go Engineer. SOLIDWORKS 2012 has added some new functionality at the drawing level for tables. The first table we're going to look at is a punch table for sheet metal parts. We've got a drawing of the sheet metal part started already. And what we're going to do is we're going to come in and select the table, insert tables, punch table, define the origin and the faces that we want to include. And what it's going to do is going to give us an individual tag for each of the different punches. We can come in and we can combine the same punch type that gives us the X and the Y location, as well as the angle that the punches are in there. And we've got a couple different louvers at different angles, so it's going to identify how we're going to put those in. So I think that'll be a nice enhancement for the sheet metal uh, shops that are out there. On sheet two, we've got another fairly simple part, and we're going to come in with another type of table, and we're going to pull in a whole table. Now we've had whole tables for a while, but this has got a little bit of an, a new enhancement for 2012. With the whole table, we've actually got the ability now to include um, drill letters and drill numbers as opposed to just the drill diameter. Now, this is not an option with a right click on the table. We actually need to come down through the tools options on into the document properties and into the whole table and check this checkbox for show ANSI inch and number drill sizes. So again, this is Tony Riggs with Go Engineer. I hope you enjoyed this video.